Hey, you're just in time. I just got this package. Come on inside. I want to show you something kind of cool. So what we have here is reclaimed American chestnut. Follow me down to the workshop while I make something from this, and I'll tell you the tragic tale of this mighty species. The American chestnut, Castanea dentata, was ever present in eastern forest. Stretching from Georgia to Maine, one in four trees were American chestnut, and as a foundation species, they were vitally important to the ecosystem, benefiting everything from bees to humans. The chestnut was a large, almost prehistoric species. It rose 100 feet tall and was 10 foot wide, 20 foot around and boasted an acre of leaves. But in 1904, something happened to fell this mighty giant. The importation of Japanese chestnut to the States brought with it a fungal infection, Cryphonectria parasitica, that almost immediately began to ravage the American chestnut population. The blight manifests as cankers that attack the phloem, xylem, and cambium, the very life source of the tree. These cankers contain hundreds of millions of spores and are remarkably easy to spread. On a single flight, one woodpecker can spread a billion spores. A single breeze could spread trillions. The mortality rate of Cryphonectria parasitica is 100%, and by the time Nat King Cole sang chestnuts roasting on an open fire in 1946, they were gone. In 35 years, the American woodlands lost 4 billion American chestnuts. Today, according to the USDA, there are only about 100 trees left. In 2008, in my home state of Ohio, the ODNR recognized an adult American chestnut somewhere near Lake Erie. They have kept its location a secret. All is not lost, however. Organizations like the Templeton Foundation and the American Chestnut Foundation are working hard and using genetic engineering to try and bring the American chestnut back from the brink. And maybe, just maybe, our grandkids will be able to enjoy this majestic tree once again. And there it is. The story of the American chestnut is a cautionary tale about the value and fragility of our ecosystem and how we as humans can have an impact on our environment and how we have the power to fix it. Mm -hmm.